What's going on guys? Uh, welcome back to the next video on learning uh, PHP. My name is QDS Danny and you guys watching my channel Coraiwood. Alright, so before we begin we go ahead and uh, you guys go ahead and check your uh, WIMP which is if you guys see the color green. Alright, so in this video we're gonna see what is comments inside uh, PHP. So we put a comments in PHP and we're gonna go and check our website if we can see our comment and if you guys come here and check there is no comments here or comments not showing and uh, as soon as the PHP comes in and reads this it's just gonna ignore but if you guys put it somewhere around here uh, HTML comment and the HTML because this is not a HTML HTML and if you guys see here HTML because the HTML and PHP is two different uh, languages uh, PHP is uh, by itself it's a language but it's embedded language it's a preprocessor may preprocessor it means coming it comes on the on the top uh, so you guys can put it on the top you guys can put it inside the body anywhere uh, inside this uh, HTML HTML uh, and PHP works hand in hand uh, so uh, but uh, PHP is just like uh, C C++ with the exception of this dollar sign uh so and the comment is exactly like t and c plus plus or c sharp so if you guys go here in, even inside here and if you all guys open another php tag here so this is called tag and you guys every time you guys need to put a php you guys needs to declare it that uh, you guys need the php and if you guys put it here and you guys put it this is another comment and you guys can see your comment again you guys can see so you guys can see your comment because it doesn't matter any anywhere you guys inside put it put it inside the PHP you guys can see your comment so even if you guys can put a multi-line comment so if I put a forward slash and two star and if I go like this press enter I'm gonna see the my um, I'm gonna see sublime text it's keep putting uh, my uh, line so if you guys put a forward slash and two stars and uh, if you guys press enter the sublime text straight away detects that you guys intending to put a comment so because comments are very common inside the PHP uh, my PHP file name file name and if you press enter PHP version file PHP file version say uh, 1.0 any PHP files you guys open written by professional PHP programmers you guys find the comments all the time in front of the variables in front of the classes uh, in front of anywhere that uh, programmer feels that like you guys know because comments is for for yourself because you guys gonna write a lot of codes and down the track you guys might uh, forget which which uh, which codes doing what so you guys need the comment uh, put a comment so it's for yourself it's good for you and for others that we're gonna read your code all right so we put a uh, this is is my files function what my file is gonna do attributes or anything so you guys can put a multi-line comments like this even if you guys if you guys can save it and if you guys look at here you guys cannot see your comment this comment is just for for yourself for the programmers uh, for internal um, files or anything for only programmers because down the thread thread you guys uh, when you guys learn your PHP and you guys gonna put a files open only with PHP so the PHP is gonna run all the way from there you guys gonna put your uh, methods you guys gonna put your classes you guys gonna put your functions polymorphism name it you guys gonna do a lot of things inside the PHP and for every function or method you guys need to put a comment say if you guys wanna do the login you guys need to put a class login and a class register and you guys gonna class user the class user is one of the most important thing inside the PHP so you every PHP programmers learns from the class user class user 
because user we are revolving around the users users the ones gonna look our websites and you uh, we have to make our websites for the users so for the users to use our websites and we're going to interact with the users so user is very important in the php and for that classes you guys because you guys need a lot of classes or methods or functions you guys need to know the comment how to put a comment and how to put a single line comment so this is a single line single line comment and that's a multi-line comment this is a multi-line comment normally multi-line comments appears in front of the classes or function methods and normally it conveys the version number php file number and what this uh, file number what the specific file number or function function or method does so commenting is very very important in php one more thing is php even though you guys see that i put a literal string here and i put an integer here if you if i'm going to put a point say put a point of five or nine zero my files gonna look at the 500.90 so 500 sorry put a nine if i do i put a zero it's not gonna show zero i'm gonna tell you in future uh, videos why, why it's not showing so even though uh one more thing i tell you about the you guys that if you if you put a point nine here here 500.9 so in here you guys see this is 500.9 and even though i did not put a, any float or anything but a double but it still see my 500.9 and that's how php is going to work it displays its embedded language and that's how we put a multi-line comment and it uh, the multi-line comments even if it's single line or multi-line the php is just going to ignore your comments all right uh, that's it for this video guys uh, if you guys got any question or comment just leave it below otherwise i'll see you guys in the next video and bye